he stumbled across something strangely out of place in the Pantanal's wild plains. This building up ahead, and definitely abandoned. No sign of light or life at all. Places like this, when the human inhabitants move out, become homes for other creatures. And if there's any access to it, I'm sure there will be animals coming and going. This goes against my better judgment. Okay. God, I don't really want to go in there. I'd rather be walking about out in the forest than being anywhere near this house. This place has been taken over by animals. There's kind of crap all over the floor. I'm not sure what's left that. Maybe a fox. Oh, it stinks. It really stinks in here. Jeez. Look at that. There's like some blood that's dripping down the walls. It's just kind of stench wafting out of this room. Very strong, animally smell. sneak up on large mammals, using their acute hearing to home in on the sound of breathing. Then, with special thermoreceptors on their noses, they detect hot blood flowing close to the skin. This is where they bite and feed. It's official. I found the most disgusting toilet on the planet. These hideouts are safe places for the vampire bats to take refuge during daylight hours. When they return to the roost, they regurgitate blood to share with the young and other hungry bats in the colony. I know they're just an animal doing what they do, but it's disgusting. <laughs> oh. never been so glad to leave a place in all my life. It's an unsettling encounter, and not what Gordon is looking for. With dawn approaching, he heads back to camp. <laughs> 